to finish digging and now we've just made the holes where our poles need to go into. to put a few more cuttings in. Um, I have a little test bed where I try out varieties first before I put them into my main patch. So what I look for is um, whether they do grow well in our climate. <clears throat> I look for what the colour looks like when it's dry, what the flexibility is, how high they grow, how fast they grow as well. So I really don't want uh, very vigorous varieties. Um, I also um, look at what diseases they might attract or not and um, how they do. So I usually keep them for maybe two or three years, keep an eye on them, maybe use them a little bit. So I have a little corner here that I've already had some in from last year. Um, this year I bought some more cuttings. As you can see, these came from West Wales Willow in Wales, obviously. Um, so I would recommend um, if you're looking for cuttings to go and have a look over there. Um, they have a wide range of um, willow varieties. Um, a little bit hard to choose from because there's so many of them. But um, yeah, have a look at their website. So a question I get asked a lot is about how far apart you space your cuttings. Now this is like how long is a string uh, kind of a question. The thing is, the closer you put your cuttings together, um, the less shoots your um, um, stumps are going to um, send up because there's only so much nutrients available in the soil. Um, when the uh, willows are closer together, there's only so much growing they can do. Um, also, the stumps will stay smaller and they won't um, last as long, so they mightn't last um, 20 years they might just die off um, sooner. Um, if you plant them further apart then you get more shoots. The stems could last for 
a, a long long time hundreds of years um, um, the shoots might be slightly chunkier though and maybe have a little bit more of a curve to it so the the kind of the best way to plant it would be somewhere in between and kind of the rule would be um, 30 centimeters or a foot apart in the row and two feet or 60 centimeters uh, apart uh, between the rows that is kind of the guideline I usually give um, if you have varieties that are a little bit more vigorous and you don't want them to grow too big I would put the um, cuttings closer together <clears throat> so um, there's no real rule there's just kind of guidelines and you kind of see um, what might work for you Thank you. 